Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to Kelvin's Kitchen. On this episode, we are making spicy pork ribs, Korean style. To begin, in a small mixing bowl, add in a quarter of a cup of regular soy sauce. Followed by one tablespoon of sesame oil. Three tablespoons of rice vinegar. About a quarter of a cup of green onions. Two tablespoons of brown sugar. One teaspoon of kosher salt. Six cloves of garlic, minced. Half a cup of Korean chili paste, also known as gochujang. Half a cup of ketchup. One third of a cup of sriracha. Then whisk until evenly incorporated. Preheat your oven to 275 degrees. Then get your rack of ribs onto the cutting board. And to make sure that the ribs are soft and tender, take the time to take the main brain off from the back, just like so. With a paring knife, lift a bit of the main brain off just to get it started. And then you can just pull it right off. By doing so, the ribs will be soft and tender in your mouth without any resistance. Now, on a large baking tray, place a large piece of aluminum foil. Transfer the ribs onto the aluminum foil. Now, you want to cover the ribs with a spicy, yummy Korean sauce. Spread out the sauce as even as you can and do this on both sides. Reserve about a third of a cup of the sauce to be used later on. Now, place another piece of aluminum foil on top and we want a tight seal here. With your fingers, go around the sides and fold them in. Now, bake at 275 degrees for two hours. And after two hours, get them out the oven and remove the aluminum foil from the top. Then, with a pastry brush, brush on the rest of the sauce that we saved. Meanwhile, change the temperature of your oven to broil. 
Now broil for about 5 to 10 minutes and keep an eye on them, you don't want them to burn. And if everything goes according to plan, your spicy pork Korean ribs should look like this. Super moist, soft, tender, and delicious. And now you are ready to eat. And there you guys have it. Korean style spicy pork ribs. Enjoy. Buen provecho. Thanks for watching.